Well, hello everybody. We're gonna, I'm gonna do a really quick demo because uh, what is trending right now is um, the deep in system powder, acrylic, etc. So I'm gonna show you how you can do it without buying the expensive kit. What you have at home, maybe it's all what you need. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you, I have the base coat and I have shiny and also I have some of my acrylic powders I have some black and then I have some yellow and purple and pink and you might have this at home as well and this is my demo that I did so we're gonna work on that and then I can show you let me clip this phone right here Just gonna wait a little bit so people can join a little bit. Just wanted to see if the light is good. Okay, well, I'm gonna do this demo and then you can share later or watch later because it's gonna be really fast. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do, um, you're gonna do a regular nail prep. Um, you're gonna use your nail prep and primer. And after you do your nail prep, what we're gonna do is gonna use our base coat So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna open our base coat and we're gonna apply the, the base coat all over the nail. Just a thin coat of base coat. And then I'm gonna cure it. Cure it for 30 seconds. I mean, sorry, cure it for 30 seconds. Um, when you do this, base coat you can either do any color that you want and I don't like dipping the nail on my products so what I'm gonna do is like I'm gonna everybody has one of these I believe at home so we're not gonna dip the nail what we're gonna do we're gonna bring the client's hand closer to or acrylic and then we're gonna scoop it and then we're gonna pour it on it so just make sure you do it right and after that just take the excess and then we're gonna cure it I usually cure it for 30 seconds 40 seconds just good enough that the base coat is um, hard so while it's curing right there I will show you again so what are we gonna do we're gonna use our base coat after you prep the nail. So I'm gonna use the base coat all over the nail. And you clean your little scoopy. And you're gonna sprinkle the acrylic powder all over the nail and cure it. 
So while well, that one is curing, so we here, here we are. So what we're gonna do again, we're gonna do another coat. So you do apply base coat again, all over the nail. And go back to your yellow. Take the excess. Oops. Put it back in. Here. Are you making a big mess? Let's go fix that. So what are we gonna do it here here with our with our purple one? We're just pretending that we switching hands. So we're gonna do another coat of base coat from Enel Couture all over. So if you make a big mess, don't worry, because we're going to file, right? So it might be more even. Here, so bring my other one. So let's say that I want to do an ombre with this yellow one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring my white one. But before, I'm going to apply base coat. And then I'm gonna use some of the chrome white. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna apply a little bit of that and cure it. And I'm gonna bring my other one. So this one, because it's already like, it has two coats already, so you don't wanna be too thick. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grab my um, Twiggy file here. And I'm gonna file it. Maybe you can see, but you can try to do my best. Yeah. Oops. I'm not home. So just file like how you will shape. Money. I'll bring my brush and if you're just doing a full uh, full, uh, full color that's all you do like I dip it probably twice or three times depends like how much do you want after that you just apply shiny on the whole nail And that's it. So let's see what is cooking over here. Oh yeah, I'm doing my ombre. So same here. Gonna apply a little bit of base coat. Sprinkle my mm, yellow because I already did the white. And I'm gonna cure it. And even though, like, even if you don't cure it, you can just go and put some of the eternal beige. 
Oops, I have some of this blood is cute. So you can see that. It's pretty easy and I don't know what is this so going so crazy and um, trendy. But you don't need to buy an activator. It's, for me, it's probably safer because you're not using a resin. You're not using uh, the activator. That is what it is, it's just glue. So we're using base coat. Uh, shiny and any, we can see here, all my acrylic powders that I have. So let me see again. If you miss it, I'll show you really quick again because it's really cool. That is trendy. So at least you can try without spending money on, you know, these uh, fancy kits. So if you have base coat, remember, after you prep the nail, put base coat all over the nail. Don't cure, because I said that before. Don't cure. And um, let's go do this purple one. Don't dip the nail. I mean, you can if you want, but I would say just do this like little ombre. So I don't want all over the nail, just like on the tip right there. Thank you. Let me see my other guys out right here. So here is the one that I did before on purple. And this is the one that I tried to do my ombre in. So and because it has it's acrylic, you can hear that you can hear the sound. It's acrylic sound like this here. So and after that, I'm just going to apply shining. And that's it. And I'm going to cure it. So for shiny, I do 90 seconds on my UV light. So we come back here. Try to do a number here. So we're going to do another coat or base coat. And because the first product you're applying is base coat, you can suck off this uh, product. I'm just gonna do it again. So it's more noticeable. And just on the tip there. So I'm trying to create like a ombre look. I'm gonna kill that. And maybe my other one is ready. So you can see this one. This one is the one that I did it with a little bit of white here and then I have the green. I have done the full color and two kind of ombres. So that. So let me go back to my other one. So this one, I'm gonna apply another thin coat or base coat. And it doesn't matter if you build it up because you're going to file, right? It's not going to be like all bulky and stuff. So after that, I'm going to apply this guy. It's really cool. I really like it. Everybody likes this one for um, marshmallow white for ombre. Oops, I touch it. So I'm going to apply uh, marshmallow white. It will just give a little bit of a sparkle. So this one I wanted to apply just on the top. So you can see, kind of cool looking already. More on the side. So 
I'm gonna cure it. And after that, I'm gonna file and just apply shiny. And that will be it. Just really quick demo, just to show you that you probably have stuff like this at home. And you can try it first before you do you not know, jump into the wagon of tipping nail system. Try it, see if you like it, see how, how long it lasts. And then when you put base coat first, like I said, you can uh, always suck the product off on acetone or like whatever you have for that stuff. I usually like to remove nails with my e-file. So this is what I've been using, base coat or shiny and or a click system. Any acrylic system will just work just fine. So here is or my last one. So I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is like you can see it's all bulky and stuff. So what I'm gonna do is file okay. uneven so you just like you would do when you do gel nails or acrylic nails right you just have to shape them not too much because it's not too much product and after that I will just use my buffer smoothie This is marshmallow white that I put on top for the white. So we have a little bit of sparkles. And just your brush. And now we're just gonna apply shiny and cure. I have a UV light, so I usually cure my my shiny for 90 seconds on my UV light. So you can always share the video so it stays there and people can see it. As you can see, it's super cool. So I'm gonna cure that. And that will be it. So hopefully my next client, she let me do this uh, this technique so I can uh, see for myself how long that will last, how the nails are gonna do without me spending on resin or activator, just using your base coat, your acrylic powders and shiny so this is a really important duo even if you just want to do gel nail i mean gel polish you use your base coat any gel polish and your shiny cure for 90 seconds and uv light and you're done you can do it uh, for gel toes like manicure gel polish i'm gonna um, close these things before So here, so here are my nails that I just did with the dipping, um, no actually a dipping but a technique that everybody is going crazy for it right now. We just did it with, uh, with our base coat or shiny and our acrylic powders. So and we have like a, a 30 new acrylic powders that are pure color, so you can find them on our website. And we have our, uh, these guys are coming um, in a set of six, I believe. Yeah, six of them. So you have a variety of uh, acrylic powder just to try it out. And you can find our products at inelcouture.com if you're in the USA and inalcouture.ca if you're in Canada. We ship all over the world. 
and here we are well i hope you liked it um like i say share so everybody can see it and everybody can try it before um they jump into the dipping system and let me know what you think okay we'll see you in the next video thank you bye